Hi guys, I found a great little device on eBay. And it's called a charging discharge voltage monitor control board module. What a mouthful. And uh, the, the plan here is to use this on the active equalizers or, or balancers to augment your BMS systems. And a lot of you have problems because you don't want the active uh, balancer on um, all the time. You want it only on uh, near the top most of your, your charge. And I want to have it coming on at uh, 3.45 volts per cell. Uh, this has a, a maximum voltage uh, range on this board is 50 volts, but my power supply only has 30, so that's why I'm using that to calibrate it with. You could probably go across 13 if you have a way of setting up your system and, and verifying it all works other than actually going live on your batteries. But uh, so I'm going to be using 8. So I've set it up uh, 3.45 volts times 8 cells, 27.6 volts. And um, uh, take the average across 8 cells so you don't get any false tripping because you're not monitoring one cell that happens to be balancing. Uh, using uh, program P5. And how you get into that is real easy. Push and hold. Now you're P5, you can toggle up in your programs with these two buttons here. Push it one more time. And now you're into the, the voltage and uh, that you can set with these two buttons. And then you're into the voltage B. And that's not uh, usable in this program. In the other videos, hit it one more time, get it back to the, the run. And while it's in run, you can hit these two buttons here and you can adjust uh, your uh, base voltage there and fine tune that and then you can turn it off the display it's still active but the display is off so you're saving power it's powered through this little wall wart here 12 volt so it's not a big deal anyway i uh, bought that on ebay i'm sorry amazon on this one has a nice little switch and a nice little screw adapter and some of you might be wondering, well, okay, you're running across some cells. Uh, are you depleting those cells if you happen to choose? Uh, I'm using uh, eight cells, uh, cells out of my 16. Will it deplete some of the voltage? No. There it is right there. I've got six turns through a fairly sensitive uh, amp meter. And I'm turning it off. And the output is off on the, on the power supply. It just floats around. It's back on again. Nothing. So, I think that's a good little device here. Uh, a lot of guys have realized that if you have an active balancer on all the time, that's going to cause more trouble than it's worth. So, this might be the solve. Um, if you've got one of these smart type, um, you're going to be wanting to intersect into this red line. And as I said before, uh, the run position here. Uh, this smart type here is actually the latest and greatest. Uh, works on the Apple app instead of the uh, Android. Uh, just got this uh, off eBay, and I'm going to be running a test on that. As I forgot to mention, that this one being one of the later units does have um, on voltage and off voltage setability uh, at a good uh, precision level. Um, also forgot to show you this in action. I'm going to bring this up in voltage a little bit here and watch it trip. There you go. Can't ask for better than that. Bring it back down. And there you go. Um, display is not quite as accurate as the true settings internally. So I'd rather have the display not being quite accurate. Um, now, I mean, that's about as close as you, you really need. Now I'm going to turn it down. There, just went off. Close enough. Very nice little unit.